welcome one and all to my YouTube channel, Technobabble. I am the Technobabbler here with my very first ever Rags to Riches series. And yes, I am in the beautiful world of Sulani. And not only is this my first ever Rags to Riches, but this is my first time ever actually playing here in Sulani. So I am super excited to get into all of these firsts for the first time. Now, if you have not yet watched the introduction video and cast video to who is going, who we are going to be following along in this exciting journey, you can click right up here in the upper portion of your screen to take a look at that. But I will give you just a real quick uh, introduction to our main char character. This is our main character. This is Nathaniel Page. And yes, you guys see, he still has money. We're going to take care of that here in a minute. And he has a guitar. I let him bring the guitar with him. I know that traditionally the Rags to Riches series, you have you start with nothing, and that's going to be how it is. But the concept behind my Rags to Riches, the little ever so slightly different uh, spin on it, is that Nathaniel just aged up. His family is in the world, and he is in that time period before he can go to college or university because he just graduated, he just aged up, he's a young adult, and it's sort of like his summer vacation. And again, this is a lot of firsts for me. I have aging on for the other Sims, The the it is going to be in the long sense, and I also have the seasons on for 28 Sim days. I've never done that either. I've always just done the seven days. So right now we are literally in perpetual summer as the rest of us who are in this hemisphere, the same hemisphere as me, we are uh, entering fall. So it's very cold outside today. So I'm excited to be here in the beautiful, warm, sunny area of Sulani and experiencing everything that this uh, world has to offer. So I'm just ready to sort of dive in the really what we're going on. What's happening with Nathaniel here is he's just kind of wanting to be out on his own. He packed up a knapsack with just some clothes in it. He's got his guitar. He said to his family, he's going to Solani. He wants to be away. He doesn't want to work. His dad really, really wanted him to get a job and just work and sort of, you know, earn some money before he goes to university. And he was like, I just want some time away. So he may find out that he's going to become rich in other ways as the Rags to Riches series, you know, are supposed to go. He might discover that he likes kind of just being an island bum and not having to have a job. We are going to figure out all of that, and we have 28 sim days to explore that here in the wonderful world of Sulani in the summertime. So let's dive into some gameplay. So, the other thing I mentioned in the other video is you can see this is his hair right now. In every three episodes, I'm going to change his hair. It'll either get longer or shorter, so he'll either let his hair grow or he will go and uh, get a haircut from someone or someplace. So right now, okay, you guys, I'm just... I'm really excited about, I got to go in this water. I just have to go in this water. So we are going to put up our guitar for right now. This is our uh, our lot. Uh, I don't even know the name of the islands because I am so new here and so green. He's feeling a little hot. So let's go ahead and see if we can come in here and let's swim around because you know what? I am excited to see how that looks. Have him walk right into the water. And I know you guys have all probably seen lots of this. But Nathaniel has not been in the water, and neither has Technobabble. I have not yet seen this animation in person. <gasps> Just walking right into the lot. I love it. Oh, and he's going to get a little exercise. Uh, the lot, I did give it some traits. Let me pop in there just real quick. Just like I said, these are, you know, those first episodes. You have to have all these introductions. It's still called Lagoon Look. That's where we are at. I gave the lot the trait Bracing Breezes. Uh sunny aspect and peace and quiet because that just seemed very natural and seemed very fitting for this gameplay so i guess the first thing we need to do is uh let's go ahead and uh clear his money so i'll do that give me just a second all right i used the cheat to get rid of his money so he literally has no money and he's probably going to be getting working up a little bit of a hunger uh, we are close to this, uh, beach over here, so maybe there is some barbecuing or grilling or doing something over there. I guess we should probably, I know that I've seen people do this before. You can click and you can beach comb. So let's go ahead and do some beach combing, and we are going to beach comb for some seashells after he is 
done swimming for a little bit. I am loving this water, you guys. This is beautiful. Oh, some Sims. I need to come meet these people. They're just hanging out by the buoy. I love it. All right, but first, uh, you know what? He is, let me see, what are his traits? We are starting our aspiration off with the party animal because that is really what he is. Oh, he wants to introduce himself, so maybe before we go beachcomb, let's uh, pop over here and see if we can introduce ourselves. I'm having trouble navigating around the water. And come introduce ourselves to the Sims. And can I call this person over to us, maybe? Let's see, we can click on them, and we can say call over. So I will call them over, and <laughs> who is that? I'm excited to meet these sims. Uh, is it just me, or are the cameras kind of like crazy here? Well, this is a very pretty sim. She's swimming in the ocean here. Just a fish. Look at all the fish, you guys. This is like wild. Uh, all right, we kind of come over and introduce ourselves, because that is something we want to do. So we're going to start with trying to at least introduce ourselves to 10 different people. What else is he wanting to do? He needs to take a nap. He is a lazy sim. Have a water balloon fight. That does seem fitting. Uh, he is very confident right now. That's good. Look at that fish. It's like swimming right on top of the water there. Where to go? Where to go? Where to go? Man, I'm having a hard time with these controls here. Sorry, you guys. Let me see if I can get this fish. Where did it go? Oh, well. It'll show up again, I'm sure. Or if we go into this view. There it is. I see that fish. All right, so he's introducing himself to her. And let's see, shh, do we get to know, what do we What do we, we know her yet? name? Her name is Mele, I think that's what it is, Kahana Nui. And she is married. Oh, it looks like this is her spouse coming over now. Well, let's keep getting to know her a little bit more. We can, uh, let's see, brighten day. He is feeling uncomfortable because he is so fatigued. He is a lazy sim, of course. Uh, that is from his, he lived, lived a pretty cushy life, as, you know, most sims tend to do in these rags to riches. Uh... He had a pretty cushy life, and so where we're at now is he is just wanting to find his own way out in the world. And of course, he did buy the last thing he spent his uh, last little bit of money on was a ticket to Sulani, and he is now living here just on the island uh, on this beachfront property, which is really easy to come by here in the world. So I think I'm going to have him just kind of swim around for a little bit more and introduce himself to, oh, I guess the husband's gone. All right, so he's getting pretty tired. We need to go introduce ourselves to some more Sims and probably make some money. So I'm going to have him stop chatting for now, and he needs to come over here and go back to beachcombing. And we're going to beachcomb for some seashells, and then maybe we'll beachcomb for some trash. Uh, because, you know, we, we don't want the world to be a messy place, and we don't want our home to have trash on it. But I guess that's part of the whole Sulani world is that you want to make it nice and clean and, and a, a happy environment for everything and you'll start to see changes i guess if we are actively cleaning up and helping clean up make the world a better place so let's see what do we got uh i show you guys his traits yet so right now he is a glutton he's lazy he's self-assured and he's gregarious so he these things this is the first time i ever created using the story mode and these are the traits that were chosen for him I'm thinking as we move on, we may, what do we find? One finger of Sulani. Cool. We may actually change these traits as he starts to grow and develop as a character. Uh, I think that would be fun. Oh my gosh, these stars. Look at this sky. I love it. I love it. Uh, all right, let's see. Taking pictures over here. Let me see what he got in his inventory. We have now. One fingers of Sulani, and it is rare. The rarity is uncommon, so it's not common, and it is worth 385 simoleons. Uh, we could start making some money already. I think I'm gonna hold on to that just because it says it's uh the rarity is so low. And I'm guessing I could go over to this beach and take a nap in there until I can do something else. I'm gonna beach comb, and we're gonna beach comb for some trash some more, and we'll beach comb some more for some seashells. And beachcomb for some more seashells. We haven't found a seashell yet, which is kind of odd. And I guess we really need to get out there and explore the island a little bit too. So I'm going to have him do this for a little bit, see what we find, and then maybe we'll head over to that beach and have a little snooze in the lounge chairs. Okay, so Nathaniel just walked down the beach a little bit 
And now there are some more people to meet. So we are going to do a friendly introduction here. And we are going to get to do a friendly introduction here. Because we need to get to know all of the Sims on this island, I think. Because he's so gregarious. He's probably like searching around to find out if there's like a party he could go to. Or an event that he could go to. Because he's going to be getting hungry. Is there like a... Well, there's his brother. Why is his brother here? <laughs> there's his brother. That is Gunner Page. Who's this over here? That is a local sim. Maybe we can call him over and we can do an introduction with him. Uh, let's see. We need to get to know these two lovely people. We have Liliana Kealoa and Oliana Nagata or Gata. I don't know if the N is silent. But we'll definitely start to, uh, you know, just get to know these guys. He's gregarious. He wants to uh, get to know them. He wants to find out anything he can about them as well as the island i suspect also there is another sim walking by can we call her over i feel like we're just going to be like shouting to everyone <laughs> hey come on over i want to get to know you but that seems like nathaniel oh he's going to come over here and introduce himself to this guy oh he can't talk to this guy he is too busy building a sand pile i think that's hilarious of course you are on vacation sort of i guess when you come to salani or at least that's the way it feels to, uh to me right now and that's how it feels to nathaniel all right, we've introduced ourselves to uh, four people so far. Let's uh, maybe enthuse about guitar solos. Let's maybe flatter. And uh, let's do a heartfelt compliment and see if we can't get to know this sim a little bit more, too. We could also discuss local fishing spots. She does seem like she's a local. Uh, this is Elani Mahai, Mahaya, Mahaya? Man, I am botching these names. I apologize, you guys. But, you know, it's a learning curve. There's a massive learning curve there for me. I don't even remember if I told you earlier that his name is Nathaniel Page. But that's why I told you you should check out that video. So if you haven't yet watched the uh, cast video where I create him in story mode for the first time ever, here is another link up at the top of the screen for you to click if you want to go and check that out uh, before we get into too much of this gameplay. But I'm telling you, I'm really excited. Uh, let's see. Nathaniel Page has identified the Tetra, a new type of fish reported. In certain fishing spots. Alright. So does he get a fishing skill for that? No. So his skills right now are he's got some charisma, a little bit of comedy, a little bit of fitness, and some guitar. That's because he has just recently got the guitar as a graduation gift and was sort of learning to play it. Alright, I'm going to let these two socialize for a little bit longer, and then maybe we will take a nap over here on one of these benches, because we need to take a nap. All right, Nathaniel just got done taking a little nap here on this lounger, and after he had talked to, let's see, her name was Nalani, she had said there are some fish traps all over the place, and you can feel free to set them. It is something, an island tradition, they have these traps out for anyone to use, so he's going to come over here and set the fish trap just because he kind of wants to explore, like, what can he do on his own? He's had a pretty cush life, so... He's got to make it on his own now. Now, he does have these, uh, what is it, the fingers of Solani. He doesn't want to throw them out yet. It's the first thing he's, like, found on the island, so he doesn't even know what it's worth. Uh, but when we were finding stuff, we also found the instant hygiene drink, which is hilarious, like when he was just searching for trash, so that's kind of cool. Uh, so he set that trap, so I guess we'll come back here and check that later. He is also, oh, here's some more Sims to meet. Here, come introduce yourself to Leah. Is that her name? Leah Hauta. And, you know, get to know Leah and find out what we can, do a heartfelt compliment. We need to learn as much as we can about this island because we are an outsider here and we need to learn as much as we possibly can. So maybe we'll ask Leah about more fishing. Maybe he's going to look into fishing or maybe he needs to get some fish just so he has something to eat. He's also going to need to use the bathroom. And I think that he can go out here in the ocean and use it, but I don't know. I don't know how it works, so we'll try it. We're going to go swim there says Nathaniel Page has identified the perch, a new type of fish. Report it in certain fishing spots. All right, so we're sort of learning a little bit about fishing just from talking to the locals. So once we're out here, can we, like, go to the bathroom? What are our actions? Uh, former group. Uh, I wonder how he does that. You know you're not going to go grill. You can't even... You don't even have any money to grill. How are you going to grill? You can't grill. <laughs> Is somebody grilling? I was really hoping that someone would, like, grill something up. Uh, we haven't found it 
any we haven't made any money yet you can't grill you have no money quit trying to grill let's come over here and maybe talk to leah a little bit more maybe we could get invited over to leah's um house and we could get some uh food from this kind sulani stranger uh let's see or acquaintance i guess let's maybe discuss interest a little bit more let's see we know they're young adult we don't know their career they're just acquaintances and is a neighbor who lives somewhere on the island i'm assuming on this island but i have no idea I was really hoping we could... I know that you can. I swear I've seen people use the bathroom out here. I just don't know. Maybe my bladder's too low. So I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to have him go use this restroom, finish introducing himself to the rest of the people in the slot, but there's a bar over here, and maybe we could go over there and charm our way into getting like a drink or some chips or something. So I'm going to come right back, and when we're back, we will be in that bar. All right, we have arrived at the bar. Everyone that he was out there swimming with has come along, so we are going to come in here, and let's see if we can order... Oh, we can totally grab some chips. I also forgot, because he's a glutton, we can actually click on the trash cans if they're full, and we can rummage for food, but we are not that desperate yet. We are going to come in here to this lovely little bar. We should also introduce ourselves to this friendly person, and we'll do a friendly introduction. Full of chips, please. I'm hungry. Then he's going to introduce himself. He'll say, hi, I'm Nathaniel. I'm new here. And he is going to introduce himself to, oh, man, this these names are going to be a fun, delightful challenge. Uh, let's start talking to him so I can see it up here. And your name is? Can I click on you? Oh, that's weird. It's not working. Uh, Uka Panipo. Uka Panipo. Uka. We'll call him Uku for short. His new friend, Uku. Uh, we definitely need to chat with our friends some more. Uh, we will ask about day, we will maybe tell a, we'll flatter this person here, they are, she's absolutely stunning, I love this tattoo that she's got, I'm pretty sure this is the sim from the, um, trailer too. So we're just gonna sit here, and we are gonna have our bowl of chips, our hygiene has gone down a little bit, I forgot about that, I gotta think of what I'm gonna do for hygiene, hopefully, oh, 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 there's a sink back here, we can come in here and wash our hands, and brush our teeth, and get ourselves as clean as possible in the sink, I thought you could, like, maybe have a bath in the ocean, or maybe he'll just be stinky, who knows, uh, let's talk to Leah a little bit more here, we will talk about, uh, let's talk about the neighborhood, how has the neighborhood changed, you know, what, what do we need to know and this is someone this is i don't think this person actually lives here uh, but she's in an angry mood so maybe we should talk to her uh let's tell a funny story this guy definitely seems like someone who would become a good friend of ours i like his haircut too so we are just going to kind of wrap up this episode here in the bar he is going to be eating his bowl of chips and where are his bowl of chips I guess he ate them already. Maybe we can get another bowl of chips. Uh, order some chips. Uh, and then we will start the next episode off back in his uh, little neck of the woods and see what's going on because I'm going to go ahead and play a little bit off camera. He'll get to know these sims a little bit better. Uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the very first episode. You know how first episodes are. It's all about introductions. It's all about figuring out the gameplay. I am having an absolutely lovely time here in Sulani. I'm excited to explore all of these other islands. So please stick around. Tune in. I believe I'm going to try to produce these for you every Mondays and Fridays. I'm going back to my old school schedule so that you have something fun to start your week off with and something fun to start your weekend off with. So I hope you guys enjoyed this first episode. Please consider subscribing to the channel so you don't miss any of the great content coming out. And if you didn't know, I am the host of the podcast called Simmers Digest where I highlight Sims uh, creations, community members, have interviews, we do gallery walks, we do a whole lot of fun things things on the Simmers Digest uh, podcast. There's also a digital magazine highlighting all of the amazing creations that you guys create. There's a whole Simmers Digest franchise out there, but I really just wanted to plug the podcast because if you haven't yet listened to it, every Saturday I put out an episode, so it's a weekly podcast, and we are now up to, I believe, six full episodes and maybe two bonus episodes. I really enjoy producing the weekly podcast, and I think that you would also enjoy checking it out. I have been told by many Simmers that they love putting it on while they're building or playing the game. So you can check that out on your favorite podcatching app or head over to Simmers Digest on Twitter. There is a link down below for the podcast and the Simmers Digest Twitter account so you can follow all of that awesomeness. 
You can also follow me on all of the social medias at Technobabble. Uh, Instagram is Technobabble. I believe I had a tag here at the front of the episode, and there are links down below, so you can follow me on all those wonderful places. And I have rambled on for far too long. So until next time, Tomalagi! Geek!